Hello, it's Sparks here. Welcome back to Kirby in the Forgotten Land. And earlier off camera, I wanted to talk to this dude, but I feel like we should do it for the video. And apparently, we they sell stuff that we can put in our reserve for emergencies. And I didn't mean to activate that, but let's see. Emergencies. We can basically save ourselves if we're about to die, but that's a hundred. Let's just get a classic Kirby car mouth kick. Bye. So that's what that little star is. I was wondering what it was. Let's go ahead and take it and go. I thought it was for something extra special. Thanks, you'll hold your to-go order as a stock item when you need to pick them up. Hold down X. I'm sorry about that. Anyways, today you think we might be moving on to the next world, but Uncle Lynn says there's something exciting going on at the Coliseum. And I would love to see it. Oh, there's a hidden secret here. That's a red coin. You should enter the Coliseum battles. I want to watch you test your skill. Welcome to the Coliseum's reception area. You can enter tournaments here and battle rush of former bosses. If you make all the way to the end and come on on top, you win a special reward. And that's not all. We seem to have an unexpected word. You can. Our first tournament is training. All the way from Planet Popstar, stuck in this new world like us. That's right, it's Meta Knight, so you're gonna enter the tournament too. So this place is not Planet Popstar? I thought it was Planet Popstar in the future, but I guess it's not. Oh, we get a scroll for first clear reward? Okay, you're officially entered in the Meta Knight Cup. It's about to get intense in there. I can't wait. The entrance to the Coliseum is right over there. Prepare for some tough battles that head on it. Cool. We have now entered the tournament in the Meta Knight Cup. So let's see what copy ability we're gonna use. So we get lots of Meta Matoes. So we have Ice or Hammer. I feel like Hammer isn't really gonna help against Tropic Woods. I feel like Ice would. Oh, it would freeze the boots at the core. Yeah, let's do Ice. Hello, Tropic Woods. Kirby has entered the arena and the crowd has entered hype mode. Oh, yeah, it's very effective. Hey, blow your little puff of air. It won't stop me. I am Kirby. Okay. Watch out. Okay, maybe this will help. Oh, yeah, it's doing lots of damage. Okay, so this is mostly just a boss rush. So I need to start rushing these bosses. Hey, wait for it. Come on, just do one pop of smoke. Ouch. So we can bring reserve items into the Coliseum as well, which is interesting. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it looks like Tropic Woods is not enjoying this. Oh, you're frozen, Tropic Woods. Take that. Yeah, it looks like ice is more effective. Huh, this is hilarious. Huh. Do you really stand a chance, Tropic Woods? Look at all the health we just took down. Now imagine if this was a wall dice. Tropic Woods would be in big trouble. Oh, watch out for the roots. Okay, I should be able to sneak past and freeze Tropic Woods once again. Aw, oh, looks like you survived being frozen, but I will freeze you again. Oh, you're frozen. Too bad. Really, such a shame. Isn't it? I'm gonna freeze you again. Uh-oh. Oh, never mind. You're frozen. You're not gonna die out of this one. That is so cool. I really love that. Tropic Woods has been defeated, so we have five more to go. Oh, we have Pencil Drill or Sword. We didn't really get to fight Call Call line with sword before, so we'll do that. Anyways, we have the Kirby Card Cake in case we need it. I'm not sure how much health will heal, but it'll be your last resort, I guess. Yeah, this boss is definitely meant to be up close and personal. Ouch. I didn't mean to do that. And we have a shield as well. I forget I remember that. Sword has a shield. Well, it's actually a gigantic sword. 
Aha! You cannot hit through my impenetrable shield. It's not possible. And we're already in the second phase. I feel like these bosses might be weaker. Or maybe the first time I was attacking them, I just wasn't focusing on what was going on. Kirby's offensive has made. Oh, there's an announcement saying things? I didn't even notice. Oops, I did not mean to drop my copy ability. Uh oh. Yeah, Gigantic Sword is way more powerful. Maybe that's the reason why this is taking a lot less time. But we did use an Evolve Cappy ability last time, but it wasn't Gigantic Solar, that's for sure. Oops, I hit the wrong button to dodge. It's... No, it's not B, it's A to dodge. That's right. It's guard plus A is to dodge, but it also does an attack with Gigantic Sword. Yeah, we need to heal up. But we're not going to use the Kirby Car Cake. But usually in these kind of arena battles in the Coliseum or whatever it's called. In whatever Kirby game it's in. They usually, first ones are usually really easy. So what's next? Oh, I know these enemies. Let's go ahead and use the Toy Hammer. We haven't really used it as an offensive weapon before. At least against these bosses. These are just mini bosses, aren't they? Yeah. Kirby's martial might has everyone mesmerized. These evolved copy abilities are just something else. Oh wait, to dodge you just move while holding guard. Oh yeah, that's how it's in every single Kirby game. Oops, that was not what I meant to do. Yeah, I'm really bad at this. Okay, we can do this, this is easy. Water Frosty has been defeated. And should we take their copy ability? Why not? Ice might be effective against Bonkers, right? We could freeze Bonkers. He's working. It's slowly working. We're slowly freezing wild Bonkers. Well, I gotta actually dodge stuff. You move too much to be frozen. That's not... Okay. Can't actually move dodge with that. Interesting. So when you use the guard with ice, you cannot move dodge. The only way to actually dodge. Oh, but you get invincibility from that. Okay. I don't really need to worry about damage now, do I? As long as I remember to guard, I'm gonna assume that my guard force eventually breaks. So I'm not gonna use it too much. And I actually do some good old-fashioned dodging instead of just guarding. And then we should be able to circle wild bonkers and defeat it. Hey, we don't really want hammer. I better keep ice. It's interesting how it gave us toy hammer. Okay. I guess we need another metamato, unfortunately. So what's up next? Have we even battled that boss yet? Oh wait, that's the gigantic sword, isn't it? And... Yeah, it is. Yeah, wild edge, you don't stand a chance. You just gave me all the time in the world to charge. Oh! Yeah, I impended... Your sword is... I mean, your shield's not impenetrable like mine. When I have your copy ability. This swan is about to be defeated. Okay, yeah. Wild Ranger is a bit overpowered. Yeah. You can't tornado me. Okay, who's next? Is that it? That was easy. But this is intended to be a, a rush of sorts. Now, I honestly think I'm gonna keep Wild Ranger. Although, if they gave us ice for this boss, then that would've been good. Gory Mondo returns! Just be eradicated. Sorry! Yeah, Gory Mondo is like really easy. I don't even have to worry about dodging anything. Because you get a nice open arena to dodge stuff. Uh oh. 
You're getting close. Too close for comfort, Gory Mondo. Uh oh. Jump. Wild Rangers is so powerful. <laughs> it's kind of ridiculous. Nice. Time for the second phase. This is when you twirl around, which isn't really gonna help you now, is it? Look at that little mini shockwave. Isn't gonna help. Hang on to something, folks. Oh, I wish I had fast enough to read that. I'm sure you can see it in the video. So it's not too much of a concern. Boom. Take that, Gory Mondo. And that's another boss that bites the dust. And open. Ooh, we got monies. Yes, I want the special reward. Oh, next is Meta Knight. I'm not sure how Meta Knight's gonna go. We could either use Spike or Tornado. Let's use Tornado. The final battle versus Meta Knight. I'm ready. Oh, it doesn't matter. We're gonna have to be forced to use sword. Like usual with the Meta Knight battles, you have to use sword. It's just fair. Meta Knight doesn't have any copy abilities. Sword versus sword. The Lone Swordsman, Meta Knight. They have returned. Last battle's upon us, and the crowd is really going wild. Make some noise. I'm not even sure what your attacks are, okay? You sure know how to use that sword. Ooh. Okay, that was good. That was a good block right there. Oh, you're gonna charge a super attack. Okay, never mind. It was just a shockwave. I can't do shockwaves. Not fair. I have to get in close. Oh, there we go. That was perfect. Maybe we should go for a charge attack while well, they're charging their attack. No, that was not good. Ouch! Let's use the cake. Let's use the Kirby card kick. Okay, we have to actually hold it. Okay. Hold. Nice. Okay. Okay. That was a nice block right there. Okay. Are you about to swoop down and. Whoa! Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. Avoid the shadows, I'm assuming. Yes, avoiding the shadows works. Okay, you can set up for... Oh, those shockwaves are chasing me. Never mind. Oh, yeah, we gotta dodge that one. That one is deadly. I need more reach for this sword. We need even more gigantic sword. Jeez, that was an insane attack. That Meta Knight is really mad. Why must we always be rivals, Meta Knight? Can't we be friends? We could be more than just friend of me. We could stop... Whatever plagues this world. Before. Who knows. Anyways. Man Knight's been defeated and their identity revealed as usual. And we completed that arena. Victory in the Meta Knight Cup. Now where is my special reward? Congratulations on a stunning victory Kirby. Here's your hard won reward. 500 star coins. A rare stone. And you got the Meta Knight Sword Blueprint. Now you can evolve the sword ability. Take you to the Water Leaves Weapon Shop. <gasps> what? I need that. I need that right now. Pause the whole video. We're getting that right now. Whoa. Is that a Meta Knight Sword Blueprint? I want that. Gimme, give gimme. Give Alright, let me get my tools ready. Can we get this evolution started? Thanks for waiting. The sword ability can now be evolved into Meta Knight Sword. Hopefully we have enough. 1,203 rare stones. Unfortunately, we don't have enough. Uh -oh. Well, now's a good time to attempt another attempt at the help wanted minigame, World of these Cafe. The hustle gig. We can do this. I know we can. Hi. And before I, I forget, we need to get this gadget right here. Okay, Meta Mato. Honey. Okay, that's definitely Meta Mato. Okay, that's cake. 
Metamato, Metamato. I mean, Maxi Tomato, whatever it's called. Tomato, Tomato, Tomato. This is top tier commentary right here. Cake, Tomato, Cake, Tomato, Tomato. That was cake. Oh, it's rush rush. It's rush time. Lunch rush time, I mean. Alright, here we go. Cake. Tomato. There we go. Go cake. Oh, that was cake. Why I think it was tomato. That's also cake. That's also tomato. Honey. Oh yeah, that's right. They show up before. Oh, that's cake. Why am I moving the honey? It's cake. No. Oh, we still cleared it. Boom. Just barely. Anyways, let's move on to the next world, shall we? Thanks for your hard work, Kirby. Hope you can help us out again soon. Of course, any time. To the world map. That Coliseum stuff is fun. Let's see what the next world is. The Winter Horn. You defeated the boss and opened up a new area. Ooh, this looks like a fun stage. Northeast Frost Street. But actually, yeah, I'm actually a bit conflicted. I want to see if we can find... There must be rare stones waiting at the end of Treasure Road, hmm? I know there are. Oh, we haven't even done these yet. Oh yeah, we gotta do these before we move on to the nether world. I'm sorry. Toss them, hit them, the rock. Or whatever it was called. And after this, we can evolve the sword ability, and I guess that's gonna be the end of the video. Toss them, hit the bomb blocks. I think we're moving on to the next world, but I want to prioritize upgrading that ability first. And we still haven't done these treasure roads, which I was supposed to be doing those. That's annoying. Okay, now I'm close enough. So I see the gimmick of this one. You just gotta throw the bomb. Oh. Is it gonna hit? Yes, it did. Oh, and then we got one of those spike gordos over there. Come on. Yes, moving on. So we got a minute and 30 seconds left. Okay, we can just roll these bombs. Roll that one, and roll that one. I'm assuming that is the ideal. Obviously, I didn't do quick enough, but that is the ideal to roll these bombs. Oh, okay. Let's get time to rolls. I see. Okay, that was easy. Okay, and now the ideal is to aim. Ouch! It hurt, Poppy Bros. Jr. I hope you know that, right? Surely they do. Okay, that was a really easy one. Perfect! Oh yeah, it was a two-star, so I expect it to be really easy. But we gotta beat them in 45 seconds. Not today. Not today, for sure. But now we have enough rare stones to evolve our Cappy ability, and that's really all that matters. Let's go ahead and do that. And then the gacha figures. We gotta get those gacha figures. And then we can end the video. Oh, yeah, that's right. We can just return to Waddle D Town. The game was like, you're going backwards. You wanna go to Waddle D Town? Here's the button. It's right there. In the corner. In front of your face. I know I get it. Rude. Alright, let's evolve sword. Into Meta Knight Sword. Whatever that is, so are the third evolution is gonna be all character themed or only this one? Let me see. The sword ability has evolved into Meta Knight Sword. Nice. Oh, we got laser beams, I mean, sword beams. So many gas abilities. Which one's your favorite, Kirby? I don't know, but this one is epic. Mr. Sandbag doesn't stand a chance. Take that. Yeah, this is pretty powerful. Let's see what the charge attack does. Boom. Let's see. Okay, we can. Okay. And let's see what this does. The A. Okay, that still does the swipe. Okay, how about this? That does the normal slash. Okay, cool. 
No worries, Mr. Steam Bag is about to get wrecked. Boof! So this is what a tier 3 evolved ability is. Wow. That is very powerful. Anyways, it looks like we've run out of time in this video, and we didn't even get to use the gacha figures. Anyways, I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye!